Hi guys, Mike Greer here with a quick video tour of Big Data University, which is an amazing collection of resources that can help you get into or simply understand more about the IT world's fastest growing field of study, and that's big data. So what do we mean by big data? Let's go over here and look at the Wikipedia article. You notice I opened a bunch of tabs up here. I'm going to take you through some of these. The Wikipedia article on big data tells us that it's any collection of data sets so large and complex that it becomes difficult to process using on-hand data management tools or traditional DP applications. So scientists regularly encounter limitations to their research due to the massive amounts of data that's out there. So, in fact, here's a picture from the Wikipedia article. That's pretty cool to look at. This shows the whole underlying story of big data. Back in 1986, that's all the data that was available in the world. And the explosion began when our digital lives began to expand, when all sorts of devices and connections and online resources, when all of these has began capturing so much information about us. Big data began to be born in massive amounts. So whether you're talking about the field of meteorology, where you have massive numbers of worldwide sensors tracking weather and meteorologists trying to make sense of that, or whether you're talking about the field of healthcare, where we have millions of bits of information being captured about patients by their doctors, the efficacy of treatments and trends in disease or whatever. Whether we're talking about that or whether we're talking about the billions upon billions of people who are daily interacting with digital devices all over the planet with each of those devices, including the internet itself, capturing massive amounts of information. Whichever you're talking about, you're talking about a real challenge to scientists and analysts to capture, curate, store, search, share, transfer, analyze, and visualize this massive amounts of data and find truth. So there's an enormous demand right now for people who can get their arms around big data. So let's take a look at Big Data University here. Here we are at the Big Data University home screen. Now you notice from here, we can check out the about to find out it's an online educational site run by new and experienced Hadoop, Big Data, and DB2 users. These people want to learn, contribute course materials, share information, and also do some cross-fertilization related to jobs. So the site includes a whole bunch of free as well as fee-based courses, which are delivered by professionals and teachers. Here's some use cases, what we're talking about. Five high-value use cases that can be your first step into big data, okay? So big data exploration, to find, visualize, and understand all the big data to improve decision making. Looking at customers from a 360 degrees perspective, a full understanding of what makes them tick, how they prefer to shop, what they're doing. Security intelligence, extending our knowledge so that we can prepare ourselves for potential security attacks. Operations analysis, making machines and operational data available so that businesses can operate more efficiently. And finally, how do we deal with warehousing and handling and modernizing this massive amounts of data through data warehousing? So these are the use cases that the Big Data University is showing us are, are really game changers. So Big Data in Action, when we're looking at types of returns on investments. Let's look at just some examples. 20% decrease in patient mortality by analyzing streaming patient data in healthcare. 92% decrease in processing time by analyzing networking and call data for in the telecommunications industry. And in the utilities industry, 99% improved accuracy in putting the power generation resources where you need it by analyzing 2.8 petabytes of untapped data. So it's really, there's some enormous potential for return on investment. And it goes into some more specifics down here. When we talk about banking, insurance, consumer products, 
So let's just look at the healthcare thing for a second here. Click on that and up comes healthcare results, for example. So data resources in healthcare, when they are, uh, are harnessed, you can build more sustainable healthcare systems. You can collaborate among healthcare systems to improve healthcare outcomes and increase access to healthcare. All these are gone into here on this, this website. And then there's use cases themselves. Watch little videos. You can download a webcast uh, related to each of these topics. Okay, so really some good stuff on background. Let's look at the courses themselves. So here's a list of all of the courses available at Big Data University. You see they have the course listing pages and you can access that through uh, list or the curriculum map. It's also resources list and lots of free downloads. The home screen shows us all kinds of topics, which if you're like me, you have no idea what they're talking about. Uh, we're talking about streams development and IBM Blue Acceleration and Hadoop. Introduction to Pig, moving data into Hadoop, introduction to map, reduce programming. Just on and on loads of courses which you can find it also in different languages, SQL Fundamentals, uh, Database 2 Training, Java Fundamentals, and so forth. So what we see here, go to the course collection page and check it out. In addition, there are lots of resources that are available, and I think these are some incredible starting points. And for example, there's a collection of PDFs which are really nicely created free books. And I've opened one of those here, the Harness the Power of Big Data so from IBM. And they it actually published by McGraw-Hill, as I've seen here when I've looked through it. So it's uh, a prestigious publication put together by authorities in the field of big data. And in fact, it gets right into nearly 300 pages, well, 240 pages or so of information on big data nicely formatted and you can check it out on your e-reader so all set to go you go back to the resources and we see that there's a lot of information available in the different categories downloadable books getting started with uh, different architectures and so forth so whether you're interested in looking at big data from the perspective of the concepts itself just so you can understand what's going on whether you're interested in specifically learning to get into real-time analytics of big data, work with relational databases, there's lots of courses and lots of tracks available, many of them in other languages. So I recommend Big Data University. Go to bigdatauniversity.com and start figuring out how you can participate in making sense out of this massive amount of data that's being generated by humankind. Enjoy.